Hi, I'm Jeff Druick. I'm the president and CEO of Outer Reef Yachts. Today we're on board our newest launch. It's an 860 cockpit motor yacht. Um, we've been building cockpit motor yachts for about 12, 13 years now. And uh, this is our latest launch, a little bit different from our, our typical line. And um, come on on board, we'll show you around. In case you're not familiar with Outer Reef Yachts, we build custom range motor yachts from 56 to 115 feet. Uh, we have a, a nice niche in the market, uh, whereas we do build custom in this size range, which is really uh, not that prevalent in the market. And we've created this niche that uh, we've satisfied those demands of custom building in this size. Uh, we'll start off our tour about the cockpit on this vessel. Uh, more so than hardcore fishing, a lot of our owners, uh, we call it a sports cockpit. A lot of diving, uh, occasional fishing, and sort of a, um, a, a nice, nice place to recreate and uh, launching to and from the tender. It's more of an all-around space uh, to take the activities down from the aft deck down towards the water. Well, we're on the aft deck of the yacht right now. This is where a lot of the exterior entertaining goes on, uh, open very, it's a casual layout, um, wet bar, refrigerator, uh, a lot of lounging space available here with direct access to the cockpit or the flybridge. So it's got a very open flow, which uh, t lends itself very well to entertaining. A, uh, a focal point of all our, our yachts is the accessibility around the vessel for line handling. Uh, all vessels have wide side decks, and these happen to have wing doors in it, which closes off the aft deck for um, to allow air to come through or to close it off when uh, you don't want as much wind coming back here. Uh, access to the salon is directly from the aft deck through a huge panoramic stainless steel door which opens into a very in light, uh, uh, inviting light salon. We are truly a uh, more, the, more so than a semi-custom builder, almost a custom builder. This client in particular was looking for a uh, very seaworthy ocean going vessel but wanted a very light contemporary interior, similar to his last vessel. As soon as you walk into port, is a beautifully appointed entertainment bar in the port aft corner of the salon, which is designed to serve guests in a very uh, comfortable space. Forward of the bar, we have a very large L-shaped settee to port and a love seat to starboard which we can seat probably about 12 to 13 people in the salon comfortably. Lighting throughout the vessel is LED. Uh, all our boats are with LED lighting. Uh, very r bright, very airy feeling. Uh, entering up into the galley, it's a very open plan, uh, pointed with the uh, latest of appliances, dishwasher, trash compactor, convection oven, cooktop, microwave, so it's got all the, all the creature comforts, full-size refrigerator on the starboard side and freezer for the, uh, for the consummate chef. Uh, a nice feature on all our boats is this very open layout where you can see right through the boat. It's uh, fabulous for entertaining, um, but if you get to the point where you need a little privacy in the galley or for night running, uh, a great feature of all our boats is we have this hydraulic wall that will rise and separate the galley from the pilot house for either night running or for a little bit of privacy during the cooking experience. This boat is set up with an informal dining area. Uh, many of our boats will dedicate a, um, a dining room to it, uh, but in this case this owner wanted a more informal setting and um, with this setting right here with the open layout it really works well for a, a very informal uh, dining experience. Over here is the helm station. Uh, which has the latest array of electronics and gear. Um, this client in particular will cruise down through South America um, and he plans on doing a lot of extended travel with this boat. Below to the accommodation space, um, amidships and aft is the master stateroom. Full beam, full on suite head and shower, walk-in cedar closet with an entrance also to the engine room. Many of our owners operate the vessels themselves Therefore, we put direct access on all our vessels from the master stateroom into the engine room. On this particular vessel, the owner specified speed. He wanted economical cruising at around 10 knots, and he wanted to achieve 17 to 18 knots. With that, the boat was designed with C18 Caterpillars, 
1150 horsepower, which gives a very economical cruise at 10 knots and a, and a top end speed of about 18 knots. After the engine room, uh, you'll come into a beautifully appointed cruise quarters that'll accommodate up to four crew for our owners that are owner operated. Operators, they uh, occasionally use this for guests. We finish the treatments back here as the rest of the vessel, highest quality just like the rest of the vessel, and do not skimp on the uh, joinery back here because it is sometimes and many times used as occasional guest quarters. Accommodations for of the master are a queen VIP in the bow, a queen guest stateroom in the port, and twin bunks, upper and lowers, to starboard. In the, uh, in the VIP stateroom in the bow, we have a queen berth. Uh, this is finished in a high gloss maple with walnut trim and doors, uh, extruded valances to hide the air conditioning ducts. Uh, very clean, very neat, very well-appointed stateroom. Off the central hallway is the laundry center and linen closet. Uh, we're up here on the flybridge now. One of the unique features of all outer reef yachts is uh, the, the deluxe bridge. The deluxe bridge is a full width bridge that goes full beam, completely over the side decks, which creates a covered side deck below and gives you tremendous volume up here. Uh, up here on the uh, flybridge is, is a great place to entertain and relax with your family and friends. You can seat up to about 20 people up here very comfortably. One of the great features about the outer reef 86 is the fact that we've placed everything up here to do all your cooking and dining. Barbecue, refrigeration, sink, storage, uh, anything you need is up here which saves time and effort from cooking below and bringing everything up here. Last but not least, aft of the Flybridge steering station is the boat deck. As you can see there's plenty of space to accommodate a tender, a jet ski, multiple toys and still have room to put that lounge chair out. We're very excited at Outer Reef about our new 86 cockpit motor yacht. For more information on our yachts from 56 to 115 feet, please visit us at www.outerreefyachts.com.